James Coppins is suing his neighbor, Brian Bennett, for cutting down three of his trees. Mr. Coppins, you have a rental property that's located where, sir? It's located in Orlando, Florida, in Altamont Springs, Florida. How long have you owned the property? I've owned that property 20 years. Did you ever live there yourself? Yes, ma'am. Until when? Until about eight or 10 years ago. This is a single family dwelling? Yes, ma'am. And the defendant, Mr. Bennett, has lived as your next door neighbor for how long, Mr. Bennett? 2015, Your Honor. There were three mature trees on your property. And Mr. Bennett, you acknowledge that you cut down those trees. You cut them down on his property to the stump. Is that correct? I, I did have a tree company do that, yes, ma'am. When did you have the company do that? I got work. September 8th of 2016, Your Honor. Do you have photographs of those trees? Yes, ma'am, I do. I'd like to take a look at them. And it goes without saying, Mr. Bennett, that you did not have permission to cut down the trees. No, ma'am. I... Okay. Is this a tree that was cut down by the defendant? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Do you have any photographs of the trees before they were cut down? No, ma'am, but, uh, but the last photographs in there of a, are of a similar tree, similar I, in size. I'm not interested in a similar tree. So the answer is you don't? No. Okay. Now, Mr. Bennett, now it's your responsibility so that there is no question that you were on his property through your agent without his permission and destroyed property on his property without his permission. The onus is upon you, sir, to show me evidence that would render a, a verdict in your favor, because it's clear you're not permitted to go on somebody else's property. You're not permitted to destroy somebody else's property, unless there are some exigent circumstances that you'll have to convince me about. And I understand that there was supposed to be bad weather coming to the state of Florida, okay? Yes, ma'am. All is in your court. Your Honor, on um, August, I mean, September 8th, or August 20, 27th. Um, on August 27th? Yes, ma'am. We had a hurricane that was coming through. It was being announced. The governor did announce there was a hurricane, and it was lasted up to September 3rd. During that time is when I did have the trees cut off. The canopies of the trees. Just a second. Before September 8th? Yes, before the hurricanes okay. were on their way. And what effort did you make to contact Mr. Copens prior to having the trees cut down? Ma'am, we moved in. I did not know who he was. I went So and the answer the is you made no, no I did. effort yes, I did. to Your contact Honor. him. I mean, there is a registry who owns the property. If you went to town records, you could have found out who owned the property. Yes, ma'am. I, I went and knocked on the neighbor's door. His name is Dan. Um, I asked Dan about the trees. I did not at the time know, again, I just moved in, did not know who the owner was. I assumed well, he was. Well, 2015 is when you moved in. We moved in September, November 2015, yes, ma'am. So you were there a year before, the, almost a year. Almost, yes, ma'am. Ten months. Well, in ten months' time, there's bad weather in Florida. You could have found out if these trees presented some sort of a risk to your home. Do you have photographs showing me how these trees presented a risk to your home? I do the not. The answer is yes or no. No, ma'am. Well, that's a problem for you, Mr. Bennett. You can't do that. You have no right to do that, sir.